Hey guys, welcome back to WP Pen Manager. And in this video, we're gonna talk about how you can disable file editing within WordPress website. So you will probably know that WordPress has a built-in code editor inside Appearance, then Theme Editor. So this is a full-blown code editor inside WordPress environment. And you can like install a multiple type of code editor or let's say IDEs uh, via plugin section as well. Like we have over here installed this SID. So those are pretty convenient for making small changes within the website even like without accessing the uh, ftp or web hosting code manager and i always highly suggested you do not use any let's say inside code editor or the plugin editor or the theme editor over here uh, instead use an ftp because in case you make any kind of php code mistakes uh, then you get locked out out of your wordpress website and shows you an error 500 and let's say to get back access to your website you need to go inside the ftp and correct the uh, php error you made earlier so without like uh, wasting time uh, you can always go directly to the ftp and make your changes in case you make mistakes and get an error 500 you can you can fix it quickly and get back access so this is a security risk as well from some uh, like let's say viewpoint having a full-blown code editor uh, enabled over here in the wordpress website and file editing that can be done as well if you have like a malicious plugin installed somehow or maybe a backdoor inside your wordpress environment so in that way your uh, files are unprotected as well and they can be overwritten uh, using remote commands so i suggest you turn off the file editing for your wordpress environment if you are planning to like let's say uh, hardening your security a little bit more so all we need is like a single line of code that needs to be pasted over wp-config.php okay so for the better demonstration i'm not gonna even use the id over here i'm gonna straight up log in to my web ftp and we're gonna take the demonstration from thereafter okay so let me load my ftp account over here so this is the root of my wordpress installation and if you are using an web host most probably will have your root installation under public underscore html on your file manager root so inside public html you will find the wp config dot php okay always make a backup of the file you are uh, modifying before modifying it so i'm not gonna do that because uh, this is a single line of code and we can actually like edit it back as well okay so let's edit the wp config and we're gonna load the code editor okay so what we have to type in over here or paste let's say we can type it at the bottom as well or you can like let's say type it over here okay so let's say custom setting and we're gonna type in our code over here so it's nothing but let's say uh, the code i'll explain it it's define disallow file edit true all it does is disables file editing options over here in the wordpress and also disables file editing using code editor inside wordpress or um, like let's say via some malicious plugin they can modify the plugins so all it does is disables the file editing options over here in the appearance plugin editor as well. All of the IDEs that uh, provides code editing experience in the WordPress environment or let's say uh, code modifying uh, via some malicious plugin or backdoors as well. So all of the purposes are being like blocked over here by one single line of code that you can paste into wpconfig.php. Okay, so we're gonna save this file and we're gonna take a look at how it affects our wordpress website okay so let's reload so we're gonna reload this page and it says sorry you are not allowed to access this page since we disabled the file editing okay that's fine we can go back to our wp admin area and over here now if we hover over uh, the appearance section you will see the uh, theme editor option is gone okay the plugin section uh, the plugin editor section is gone and the id we had installed using plugin that's gone as well okay so one single line of code it removed all the file editing capabilities from the wordpress website over here but this doesn't mean you cannot access the css editor that built into the website so let's make that clear as well if we go to customize from appearance 
and if we scroll down the additional css is still there we can have our custom css codes over here to modify our website as well and this will also disable uh, like file editing or file modification uh, via let's say a plugin file that's been infected and a hacker uh, maybe is trying to modify your wordpress files from remote or like uh, via and backdoor so this hardens a security by a lot so feel free to give it a try if you like really find it useful just one line of code inside your wp-config.php and you are disabling the file editing option for your entire wordpress website i hope this video gave you a bit of idea about the topic today we are talking about disabling file editing in a wordpress environment if you found this video helpful toss a like leave a comment in the section and subscribe to the channel maybe so come join me in our next video where we will talk about something else something awesome until then i'm shadat saying goodbye thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next one